I like an academic essay. But what I don't like is an academic essay that makes me really work hard to read it, where it's using, you know, terminology that most people don't understand. It's assuming you know all this theory that you probably never heard of before. Mm -hmm. And so what we tried to do in, in the magazine was to write essentially academic essays. These are informed research works, but written in a way that are somewhat readable. You know, you yeah. can kind of read it and, and, and you're carried along by what, you know, by what the theory is, but also about um, also what the content, you know, what the, the, the topic is. And that's what we tried to do in the magazine. That's what I try to do when I write even, you know, now is make it accessible. You know, there's that fascinating theory there and you can make it really hard to understand and, uh, or you can try to, to work it, you know, making it easier to understand. And so my effort is to try to provide well-researched, grounded theoretical approaches to something, but also make it kind of interesting, lively, readable. Uh, I don't know if I've succeeded at that, but that's definitely been my, my, my goal. People say, wow, I, you know, that's neat. You can write these essays. And I say, well, anybody can write them. I say, no, that's actually mm -hmm. not true. Um, because academics take 20 pages to clear their throats. Yeah. Right. And they, they can't get to the point and they can't write without jargon and i think in part they feel non-scholarly writing in these non-scholarly ways and it it they feel that people won't take them seriously anymore there are so there are a lot of things that feed into that sure all having to do with socialization if you start writing for the public what you have to learn how to do is shorten your sentences and shorten your paragraphs yes. and say things clearly and not try to sound smarter than your readers. Kind of relearn how to communicate. It was a shift for me. That, and, and, and also at the same time, I had to go and keep writing the scholarly stuff. But I think that my mm -hmm. scholarly writing got better because I started writing shorter sentences.